So what's the deal, y'all? Is Megan pregnant? Is that going to be the big secret? I'm curious. You curious? I'm not sure, though. But the fact that she lost 70 pounds. So I don't know. But that explains why I can't see all kind of shit and find anything in any of these girls. So the, it's just going to be amazing. But do you think she's pregnant? Who are we talking about? What's up, everybody? And welcome back to my channel, True Feelings and Happy New Year's Eve. Please be safe out there. Some of y'all been looking for some updates on Michael, Sarah, Megan, the three students. But you know what? I've been looking, haven't found anything. They've been very tight lipped about shit. What I can tell you is Michael is still going to continue to be an asshole. And apparently there's a third woman. So um, the way Megan got him. That's how she gonna lose him. He's supposed to be cheating. So we'll see. But it's the new person he cheating with. It's the new rebuilt Megan. Megan had lost 70 pounds, y'all. And she she was pretty before. I don't care if you're big, small. She was always beautiful. As long as she don't come back with that lace front that turned into a back front. Saw her Instagram. Tried to take some shit. Picture. I, I couldn't do it. But she looked good. I'll let you guys be surprised. You probably already saw it. So she looks good. And of course, we're going to have Sarah. Sarah's going to come back. She's going to come back with a whole different look also too. I was able to get a picture of her before and after. I don't know if that shit is, uh, what do you call that shit? When they just like keep doing filters and doing weird shit. I don't know. The, the picture looks um, too filtered for, I don't know. But, but she made a transformation so and that's pretty much why they've been being tight lip you know with reality shows you see in one minute the first season they be looking you know just like regular people the way we would look and once they start getting it into the reality thing then they start getting a little extra and start changing and it's like so i just hope they don't come back with the wow factor makeup and them crazy ass big eyelashes can we stop that in 2019 them crazy eyelashes like I wanted to see if you were my real friend. I'm like, girl, you gonna do cocaine to see if I'm your real friend? Are you kidding me? I locked myself in this toy in this area where the toy is. Found something on the Clinton Tracy update. So the word on the street is Tracy might be pregnant. Now, did see pictures of them, and I, I saw this on. Um, so dirt too she actually looked good she looks healthy she pretty much had no makeup on she just she looked like a normal person or like i i like the look of tracy that i saw on soap dirt so i hope she comes with that look and get rid of the whole druggies purple hair she need to get rid of that whole damn look it was not it was excited as I am I'm excited I'm excited about Lamar and, and Andrea um, I'm excited about all the couples coming back duck lips we know they're gonna be on there for the show so just wait for it you know she gonna be doing the most because she's trying to get her own spinoff you know how this shit work you notice the shit she doing because she's doing too much extra shit and from what I heard one of some somebody put in my comments that um her husband is on webcam doing shit with her I can't look that shit up because I don't want no weird shit to happen but good lord if that is true like I said it is just for tv and she's just gonna be um just turned up but I'll still be reviewing the shit. So you guys, um, let me just say to my new subscribers and everybody who started with me from beginning to this end of 2019, thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, I couldn't do this, you know, with you. You make this shit fun for me, so I will always continue to answer comments, heart you, even if you say some shady shit to me. I'm gonna heart you as long as you don't curse me out curse out my people that's commenting being faulty say what you want all comments are valid i don't give a shit too old um i'm sorry enter 2020 on some positive vibes what you want to leave in 2019 get rid of negative negative people don't let people take negative space in your head own your shit own your flaws just own you Young ladies, that's 25, looking for a man. Stop finding people who ain't got a credit score of 800. If they ain't got a credit score of 800, say they need their own car. They need their own house. Lady, try to hang with real people in 2020. Get rid of those toxic people. They're just not for you. You know, sometimes people will come into your life for a season, and after that season is over, they need to be fried, ate, and just put the pasture out. 
Please, people, on a serious note, in 2020, I worked in mental health for now going on 19 years. Stop being afraid of the mentally ill, okay? Um, the homeless. If you see them on the street, just look at them and say hi. Yeah, they're going to ask you for some shit. But if you got keys and shit to your house and you got that dollar to give it to them, what fucking difference does it make? Just do it. Just do it. Just be nice to these people. You don't know the level of their trauma that they've been through. And for a person who's been in this field, it's, it's, right. it's asshole in 2019. Towards the end of the year, most likely, you're going to be an asshole in the beginning of 2020. So that's it. And of all my videos, don't be an asshole.